Ready? Yes, ma'am. Are you encouraging your members and whipping your members against the bipartisan infrastructure bill on Monday? You know, I n don't view it as a bipartisan bill any longer where the Democrats have now made it one over five trillion dollar bill, one without the other. It only harmed the nation even more. I'm voting no. What about your members? Do you encourage them to vote no, too? Yes, I do. Can I, yes, follow, can I follow up on that question, sure. Mayor McCarthy? Um, a lot of the things in this uh, bipartisan infrastructure bill are things that your members have backed in the past and are popular at home. What's your message to constituents, even in your district, who could get you know, millions of dollars of money for roads or broadband about no, why you're you, voting you, no? Because you don't get millions of dollars for roads and broadbands. What you get is $5 trillion of more inflation. You get a bigger socialist, uh, big government. You get a harm to our economy. And from the whole perspective of the roads being built, we had a bill that went forward that had the opportunity to build more roads, less money, have the reforms to get it done, and you didn't have to have the Green New Deal. Yes, sir. The, the January 6th Select Committee has said that they could issue subpoenas as soon as this week. If you're among the group uh, who is subpoenaed either for your information or for an interview, how will you respond to that subpoena? And are you advising your fellow members of Congress that could face subpoenas as to how they should respond? You know, I, I haven't reserved any subpoena, but it just goes to show um, there are more this is more about politics than anything else. There's only two questions that this uh, committee should actually be looked upon. Why was the Capitol left so ill prepared and how can we make sure that this never happens again? But that's not what they're focused on. Yes.